to you. So we're staying at a Scottish castle called Balcaldeen yeah. Castle and it's a luxury bed and breakfast and wonderful. It only has six rooms which makes it quite intimate and cosy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it's got a nice parlour and a nice great hall. Oh yeah, you can sit there at night and just enjoy. Yes. Whiskey? Yeah. Or, or a glass of wine and read. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. This is Balcaldeen Castle and I think it looks quite beautiful, yeah. doesn't it? And imagine it's 400 years old. It is. Uh, it was built in 1601. And we have to show you the front door because that's still the original door. Yeah. 400 years old. And our room is... Hang on. And our room is here. So in the turret is where there's the vanity, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Very well kept. And if the weather is nice, there is a lovely outdoor seating area, which we haven't used yet because we're on the road all day long, basically. Now, the only sad thing about this is that we actually booked this yeah. place together with my sister and her husband. Yeah, but they we're not allowed to come. No, they aren't allowed to come due to COVID. And we booked it very early. Jörg said, like in, you think in December 2019. Yes. yes. And yeah, we just didn't want to lose the accommodation. But we talked to them and we said we will do it again. Yeah, because now we know where to go. We know where to At go. At least on the West Coast. Or we will even go further up north yes. and spend a wonderful time in Scotland together. So we can't wait. So, this is the entrance and the original front door, 400 years old, can you believe it? Real craftsmanship. And this is the staircase. And this is the Great Hall and Parlour, which is beautiful. We are staying on the top floor here at Balcothian Castle, and our room is called Caithness. So I'm not sure if I pronounce it correctly, but we will link it down below for you in case you want to check it out. And it's a wonderful room, a nice size, and yeah, let me give you a little tour. So this is our bedroom. Well, We've already messed it up a little bit, haven't we, Herc? Yeah, yeah. Just a little bit. Not too bad, though. This is an old fireplace. And we have a tea and coffee station. I think it's a nice size, Jörg, isn't it? Yes. That's really great. And what I like is the vanity in that little turret. That's really great. I even work there on our latest video, so it's not a big space, but it's good. It's still enough space. So here you go. The view from this side. And here's the bathroom, which has a great size as well. So that's lovely. Here you go. Then this side. And what's really lovely is the view towards Loch Grenan. Grenan. I don't know. Scottish people will know how it is pronounced correctly, but it's wonderful. You know what? Let me open the window. I just opened the window and it's so beautiful today. Oh. 
honestly stunning view, so that's really nice staying up here. Good morning from the Scottish Highlands and our castle stay. Yeah, listening to the music you have to wear a kilt. <laughs> it's too cold. <laughs> It's lovely, this room is really nice, isn't it? Oh yeah. It's breakfast. I have porridge with berries. Looks very nice. And you have pancakes. Looks good. Mm. This is the Great Hall. And this is also where we have breakfast. And it's a wonderful place. It's a really nice room. And there's another parlour next door, which is beautiful as well. So that's through here. I just switched on the light. And this is a beautiful room. And when we arrive, Daniel asked us to look for two secret doors in this room. He said, one is very obvious and the other one is in. So I found that one, which is quite obvious, that, <laughs> as you can see. And the other one, Jörg just said, come and stay here and find out. But... What we can say is, it's definitely not this one, because that is far too obvious. The only thing we can tell you is that we couldn't find it. <laughs> Yeah. I was going to say hello from Donegal Castle because I'm so into Downton Abbey. Yeah, but this isn't Donegal Castle. No, hello from Inverary Castle. Yeah. And Inverary Castle was used in one of my favourite Downton Abbey Christmas specials. Yeah. And this castle, you know, is very special, isn't it? Yes, it's a Gothic style castle. Yeah. Built in 1745. Yeah, and it has a bit of a greenish colour to it, yeah. so it looks very unique, I think. Yeah, it is. So at the minute we're exploring the gardens and we can go inside later. We're not sure about filming in there, but we will see.
and I just spotted this place and if you're as big as a fan of Downton Abbey as I am, this is the exact spot where Anna, Mr. Bates and Rose were standing and I think Rose was having a cigarette. Yeah, and they were talking. It's a lovely spot. We are now inside of Inverary Castle and we can film, which is so great because then you get an overall impression. And Jörg, have a look. This room is wonderful with a beautiful china display. I think you're going to love it. I need to put on my mask again, sorry. Let's go to this wonderful. Yeah. That's beautiful. Oh, I love this one. Worcester dinner Worcester. service. We really enjoyed that. It was lovely inside, not too many people. It's Monday today, and although it's half time in Scotland, it's still quiet, and we highly recommend the place. And we just stopped for tea and a slice of cake. So this is what we're having. A slice of chocolate cake and lemon. Lemon. Mm. Yuck. Oh, <laughs> yuck. Yuck. Your mask. All the marks. Do you have a favourite room? Or did you have a favourite room inside the castle? Yeah. Which one? The hall with all the weapons. And it's so high. You know what? I think that's even the highest. Yeah. I have to wait. <laughs> 
There's yeah. the toilet next to I like that hall because that's a very good use of weapons. Yeah. Yeah, the best use you Decorative, can do. yeah. yeah best well, use you can do I really like the, the dining room and the tapestry room, so... They use the dining room for filming. For Downton Abbey, yes. Of course, and the hall. You know, I have to make you watch, watch it with me again. <laughs> Yeah, sir, there is a walled garden as well. We're walking around here. It's quite a big estate, isn't it? And yeah. And I don't believe that we can go inside the wall. Ah, okay. Well, we'll see. We'll check it out. Now, we don't have sunshine. We have little rain showers in between, which isn't bad at all. And the weather makes the green pop. It's so beautiful. So this used to be the walled garden. Looks to me like it is. Yeah, but it's private as you can see and no longer in use. Now we try to do something that we didn't have on our list actually. I don't know if you can see this tower over there. It's called Watchtower. Yeah. And we try to go there. It says it's a 5k walk. And yeah, we will try to go there. I just put on my hiking boots and yeah, I wasn't expecting this. <laughs> I'm not even dressed for the occasion, but I think, let's hope so, unexpected things can be great things, I hope. What do you think, Yuck? We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. Now, I'm walking. Yes, indeed. Continue, I don't know. <laughs> For some strange reason, the path ended here. We saw another path, but there wasn't a sign, and the grass is so high, and I'm wearing a skirt, and I'm always a bit afraid of ticks, so we don't know. So Yerk says he prepares the drone here, and we give it a go from here. That's all we can do but maybe it works out. Because the watchtower is somewhere up there. We can't see it from here. So we don't really know. I'm already on my way down now because we have a bit of rain in between and yeah sadly we didn't make it up to the watchtower but I think we still got some nice footage from above so that's good and yeah so it's not a 5k walk maybe half of it but it's fine we walked all day so that's why we got a nice excuse for a slice of cake. But you know what's really nice? We are in the middle of the woods here and there's rhododendron everywhere. It looks beautiful. Another pop of colour. Yeah, I just said we don't really have that in Germany. Rhododendron in the middle of the woods. No. I don't think we do. We were so incredibly hungry that we came to the Jörg the name Oyster Inn here in Oban. This is where our accommodation is. And yeah, we were lucky enough to get a table. That's good. And this is our starter. Scallops. Scallops, panketta and cauliflower for you. Enjoy. Silver yolk, and what does it have as well? Potatoes? Yeah, potatoes, and greens. Greens. Mushroom risotto for me. What wild mushrooms. I'm going to have an early night tonight. Sure. I know it. I, I know it. We might spend 
an hour at the Great Hall. Um, or two. In front of the fire, yeah. yeah. I bet you will have a whiskey. Yeah, I do. <laughs> and before we forget, the food at the Oyster Inn was really nice. Yeah, it was very tasty. Yeah. And we spent so many hours at Inverary Castle, we yeah. didn't expect it. Yes, but still, we couldn't find Lord Grantham. <laughs> no, we didn't. You must be, we didn't yeah. find him. Yeah, they must have locked him up in the dungeon. <laughs> but honestly, it's so worth going and we were yeah. so lucky because it was quiet, as we mentioned earlier. And yeah, we hope you enjoyed the video. What's that? It's a sheep. Oh yeah, it is. A Scottish one. <laughs> it's hungry. So yeah. stay tuned for another video very yeah. soon. Take care of yourself. And yeah, until next time. Yeah, bye-bye. Bye. Until another day in Scotland. Yes. And we thought we would share this before we switch off. It's quarter to 11 at night. It's still not dark. It's absolutely stunning outside. And this is the view from our bedroom. Wow, so quiet. How amazing.